My name is Chuck Vogel. I like to ride the bus because it's convenient, it's cheap, and uh, it pretty much will get you everywhere in town. What I don't like about it is that nothing really. I like it. <laughs> uh, my name is Bill Smith, and I like to ride the bus because it gets you places and it's convenient. Okay. It's nice to ride, I guess. And the reason I don't like it is I don't know, sometimes there's some crazy people on there. That's it. <laughs> um, anything that you change? Because you know they're talking about maybe extending hours or running on Sunday. Oh, Sunday, definitely. Yeah, definitely Sunday. Yeah. Um, and if the bus would go like farther out, like maybe like to Corville, even to like the Corville Mall, that'd be pretty awesome. Like a, in transit between Iowa City and Cedar Rapids. Yeah. That maybe way even could... if it's just like a one time, one day thing or one time a day, you know, that would be cool. But right. Sunday is way more important. The bus not running on Sundays is like you can't do anything if you don't have a license. So that's probably the most important part. Does it also force you to um, to get all your stuff done on Saturday? You know, any like if you have I to mean, grocery shop it, it's or it's nice that it's free on Saturdays, but I would rather have it be paid all weekend. I mean, the, so you'd just, pay on Saturday so you could I'll ride on Sunday? Week. Yeah, for sure. Right. Also, I'd pay seven uh, days a week to ride it on. The hours. I, I'd like the bus to run later at night. Than, yeah, was it stops running at 6:20 nice. or something? Yeah, it'd be nice yeah. if it ran till around 9 or 10. Yeah. I know in Iowa City they have buses that run till 11 o'clock at night even. And if the buses would run a little bit longer here, that'd be great. Even you know just a couple of different trips at night. Well, um, we ride the bus and we like that it's convenient, you know, that it runs. We can pretty much get anywhere in town, um, but we don't like that it doesn't run after like 6.30 at night. It doesn't run late enough, you know, because some people get off work and if I need to find a job that, like second shift, how am I going to get home? <laughs> you know, that's it. Whenever you're ready. My name is Jacob Smith. I'm taking the bus right now to head to school at the Kirkwood. It's a program I signed up through Iowa Works. And so far, it's been a nice experience. Like, no one's been rude or anything. I haven't found any complaints from so far. What's your favorite part about taking the bus? Walk, uh, uh, just sitting there and seeing the view out the window, the scenery. Anything that you'd like to have enhanced or changed? No. Later hours or weekends? Later hours would be nice considering my school program doesn't get over until 7.30 p.m. So what, ha what happens when you get out of school after the buses have stopped? I gotta walk home. How far? Kirkwood all the way to First Avenue. This is Thank you, I'm not gonna I ride the bus. Um, I come, I come from New York, Boyd, um, Washington D.C., Bethesda, Maryland. Um, uh, from Cedar Rapids, I wish they had a better bus service. I see better bus services in other places where I live. I ride the bus because I have. I come from a one-car family. I ride the bus for work. And I just wish they had better bus services, but people need transportation, there's lots of people need buses for transportation, for work, um, churches, um, activities, um, meetings, and they just wish there was just better bus services, at least until 10 p.m. at night. They do have MTS, but that's um, really... There's a waiting list and it's really, really um, filled to its capacity. And it's just people need more services for getting around. You're going. I'm Tammy and 
I ride the bus because I can't drive because of my vision and reflexes and I wish that the bus would run later and possibly even earlier. And yeah, she made good points, the lady next to me, yeah. <laughs> Your name and my name is Mary Young, and I live on the southwest side of uh, Iowa City, Cedar Rapids, Iowa. And I ride the bus because it's convenient for me. I have no other transportation, so that's why I ride the bus. I wish that their service extended a little longer to over in the evening instead of cutting off like 20 after 6 or something like that because it limits where you can go and what time you can go. That's the only thing I don't like about the bus transportation. You don't have enough time to do a lot of things that you want to do because you have to go one place, come back to the bus depot, leave and wait on another bus. Then you got to, if you want another bus, you got to wait another 20 minutes on another bus. So, but other than that, it's, it's okay. My name is Santiago. I don't like riding the bus because that means I have to wait for like another hour or so for the next bus to come. So. She's a really nice lady because she taught me all these manners. <laughs> and my grandma, she knows what to do. And she even knows when round to go home, but I can't seem to remember. That's why I don't like riding the buses. It's confusing. Yeah, I can get confused. My name's Amber Cooley and I ride the bus because I'm visually impaired and can't get a license and I love it because I can get anywhere, all parts of the day, all parts of the town. Is there anything you'd like to see changed about the buses? People stop complaining about them. <laughs> because I got in a high speed chase because of my ex. They took my license. There you go. <laughs> so, so what do you like about or don't like about it? Well, I don't like that when people get sweaty and they don't put on deodorant, they sit next to me. What I do like about it is that I put in my headphones and no one really talks to me and I don't like people anyway, so. <laughs> the bus to take the child care for me to do my daily job, searching to find jobs for me and my kids, to be a better self-sufficient mother, mm -hmm. take them to the mall and do outings and stuff. What do you like about riding the bus? On Saturdays it's free and it helps me get to places for me and my kids. Anything you'd like to see changed? Um, see belts for the kids. <laughs> Okay. Well, I'm Trevor Popple. Uh, I take the bus to get to my girlfriend's place or to uh, get to school. I'm still in high school. Okay. And what do you like about the bus? It's free on Saturdays. Yeah. Okay. That's, like the best part. What um? What don't you like about the bus? It doesn't run on Sundays. Okay. Let's start with your name. All right, my name is Carol Coppler. Okay. C-O-P-L-E-R. And, you know, um, you ride the bus because you don't drive, you yeah, said. Yeah, I don't drive. And so Bonnie and I go all over. I mean, I never knew how to ride the bus until she got me on it. And I love it. I love it. I'm able to get out, of, get out and go places. So I really like it. I really do. I think it's good for Cedar Rapids. What don't you like about it? Is there anything you change? No, not really. I don't have any problem. The bus drivers are nice. They're also helpful. No, I like it. I really do. I think more and more people are riding it than they used to. I do. Right. And I know if I worked, I'd be riding the bus to save money. <laughs> <laughs>